Kenya's tourism sector has been on a recovery course for the last couple of years, following a downturn instigated in part by the security situation. The Baobab Golf Course tucked away in Kenya's coastal region of Kilifi hopes to play a part in this process. This month, the course earned a seal of approval from the Professional Golfers Association, the PGA. Purely means that the golf course is built to a certain standard. It, we would hope that, it, that, that this affiliation will get people to realize that, you know, tour, golf is a big tourist attraction. If we can get Kenya recognized as not just a beach destination or, a, or an, 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 a destination you come to see the wildlife, that there are other things to do. PGA's approval means that the $50 million golf complex, which began over a decade ago with a vision to create a championship course complete with a golf retreat, is achieving its dream. It's also a question of maintenance. I mean, there are a lot of really nice golf courses in Kenya, but there isn't the money to maintain them, you know, in the way that perhaps would be people, everybody would like, let's say. Um, we've decided that we'll bite the bullet and we spend a lot of money on maintenance. The affiliation comes with much more than just the standards of the course itself. The PG Academy will also lend a hand to golf education. And the establishment of this affiliation. For, for any Kenyan who has an interest in golf, to actually start to become a fully qualified PGA professional. The weather in Kenya's coast is ideal for golfing in most months of the year. Now that is a factor the Baobab course hopes will bring more international golfers to its greens. During the winter months, that professionals from other European countries where it's, you know, where they can't, it's difficult to go outside. They can teach indoors, but they can't teach outside. So we're hoping that'll encourage them to, to understand that there is a facility that they can come and teach at. And in the next few years, we're going to have to spend some money developing the academy side of things with more high-tech equipment. This PGA partnership is also expected to trickle down to other golf courses across the country with golf tourists often quick to sample other playing fields whenever they travel. The Baobab course itself is known to be quite challenging for golfers. If you play it from the back tees where the pros would play it, it's very long. It is windy, so that makes it tough. Even as the golf course works to take advantage of its PGA branding, hosting tournaments will mainly depend on availability of financing, which isn't always easy to source. Celestine Caronet, CCTV, Kilifi, Kenya.